What is good guys? In today's video, I will be teaching you guys how to get OG Fortnite working for multiplayer for a bunch of different servers. This one's specifically going to be for core multiplayer, which is a new one that me and my friends are going to be hosting. It's going to be out publicly for anyone to play. We're going to have public matches hosted on both East and West servers. So make sure to stay tuned to the end of the video to learn how you can participate in this event. The first thing you're going to need to do is join the core Discord server, Project Core. It will be linked in the description of this video. Go click on it and you must follow these exact steps to be able to join. Here we go. You're going to click on tutorial and you're going to go to this section, which is going to have all the download links you're going to need. Uh, the first step, skip this first thing. We're going to skip that. It's just going to make it a lot easier is to download version 3.5, which is what we're currently hosting it on. So click it. It's going to bring you to a Google Drive and just download the version. Put it on whatever drive you want. The next step is to download Hamachi. Hamachi is what's going to allow you to connect to the server and allow you to actually see other people multiplayer. It allows the computers to connect with each other. So click on the download link and just download it. Follow the setup tutorial and you should be good to go. Next step is to download UUU client, which will allow you to um, open up the server to load into matches with other people. So click on this link, just download it. Because we're skipping the multiplayer launcher, because I can see it's sometimes inconsistent, we're going to download Lawin Server. So the first step is to download Runtime. This is going to allow it to work properly and function. The next step is to download Lawin Server. The first link is a Discord attachment that's going to allow you to open it normally and connect to the proxy. The second link is going to be to another version of Lawin. This one's going to allow you to have the skins and stuff. You're going to click Code, Download Zip, and it will start downloading on your computer. Once you have downloaded it, extract it, and in here you're going to click install packages. Once you've done that, you're going to close out of that and click start. The next step is to download Node.js. Node.js is going to allow all these things to work together. Just get the current version, follow the instructions to install it. And once you've done that, I'll show you exactly step by step how to start your game and get it running with no errors. The first step in the downloading pipeline. The first step in the running pipeline is to open up your folder with Lawin. Click start. It's going to start listening on a port. Next, click Lawin server. It's going to open up the proxy. Next, you're going to open Node.js. Next, connect your Hamachi, which the Hamachi links will be down in the multiplayer. Go to Hamachis. Enter in the username and password for each Hamachi, 1 through 10. So you'll type in core MP dash. A number one between a number in between one and ten and then the password will be core mp once you've connected to the hamachi go to your game files fortnite fortnite game binaries win64 and now you'll have all of this information next you're going to need a launcher to be able to start the game properly in the correct sequence because we are skipping the fortnite rift multiplayer launcher we're going to go to the lawan discord join go to launchers Go to seasons one through five, download the launcher.bat file. Then once you're done with that, drag it into your Windows 64 binaries folder. After you followed all of these steps, click the launch. It might take a minute, but it's going to launch up your game. Editor's note here, if your game like gets stuck halfway in the loading screen and you check task manager and it says not responding, that probably means one of your lawn isn't open. Go check that, restart the whole queue, get everything launched up again and try again. And if you have any problems, make sure to let us know in the core MP Discord server. In the next step, sorry, the music's kind of loud here, but we are going to type in for the email, any username you like. So just as an example, we'll use this here. And for the password, type in random stuff, click enter, and you'll see you will be loaded into OG Fortnite Season 3. Click Battle Royale. And here we are in the lobby with every OG skin from this season accessible. But if you would like to play Fortnite multiplayer on here instead of just sitting around in the lobby, there are a few more steps. Go back to the Project Core multiplayer and if you haven't already, like I said earlier, download UUU Client and open it. Here we now have Unreal Engine Client. Select your process, Fortnite and download this console DLL. This will allow you to queue into the Fortnite public hosted matches on our server. Select the DLL, which you've downloaded. This is a different one, but it works the same. Select Fortnite, 
and inject the DLL. It will say console enabled. Now, the next step is going to vary depending on the time of day or whoever's hosting on the core MP server. Press the tilde or squiggly key underneath your escape. You might need an 80% or 100% keyboard to be able to do this. A little black bar will show up at the bottom. This is your command prompt. Go to the Discord and go to multiplayer status. When servers are up, an IP will be posted. Copy it, paste it, and click enter to join. Make sure there are no spaces after to ensure that you're able to queue in properly. If you found this video helpful, press a like to be able to push it to the top of search results so it's easier for a lot of people to find. I will see you guys in the next video.